सो हाई डियर लियो अ वेरी वेरी गुड इवनिंग टू यू गाइज दिस इज अंजलि टैरो एंड दिस इज जर्नल ऑफ रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द लियो सन मून विनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जर्नल इट माइट और माइट नोट रेजोनेट विद यूर द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकेंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स ऑल्सो थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फ्रॉम एट टिल द फोर्टींथ ऑफ ऑगस्ट एंड दिस रीडिंग इज वेलिड फॉर एवरी ट्वेल्थ साइन दैट यूर डीलिंग विद अलॉन्ग विद योर ओन साइन सो लेट स्टार्ट योर पर्सन योर पार्टनर्स कैन फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नो एट दिस प्रेजेंट मोमेंट लियो लेट सी वट्स हैपनिंग we have the king of pentacles on the bottom of the deck is the six of wands king of pentacles represents maturity groundedness and a lot of stability kind of energy so they are think they feel like you are a powerful kind of a person you are very mature and grounded kind of a person uh, let me clarify the king of pentacles here let me see what the story is behind this card let's clarify the king of pentacles here to get to the story okay so we have the page of swords the five of wands and the six of wands okay hmm this person is watching you from a distance wow this person is uh, feeling like you are growing in every area of your life and you are heading towards a lot of success and victory in your life this is someone who is feeling like this is uh, a very conflicted kind of situation they are very very conflicted they know if they are going to come forward towards you it's going to create a lot of drama a lot of conflict and issues that's why this person is choosing to stay uh, away from you watching you from a distance and this person is not sure whether this connection between you and them is ever going to be uh, successful or victorious but individually they respect you a lot and they feel like you are doing really great in your life and they are kind of uh, feeling you are heading towards success very uh, in a very like uh, on a very large scale this is what they feel about you okay yeah see this is a double confirmation someone someone sees you as a very practical person grounded mature person and a person who is going to be successful in their life no matter what like you are bound to be successful and victorious you are bound to be uh, like center of attention of lot of people this is the kind of respect and this is the kind of energy they are uh, keeping towards you but at the same time they are very conflicted that uh, you are not going to be with them or you are going to reject them or this is not going to work out between you and them because of uh, the status or for some of you because of uh, both of you are not on the same page emotionally that is why this person is kind of holding back let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation we have the emperor okay 10 of wands bottom of the deck see you are just uh, showing them that you are just uh, on the right track in your life you are happy in your life you don't need anyone to fulfill you or to make you happy you are just taking the charge of your life so beautifully in your hands that everyone is going to be influenced by you and your powerful nature so right now you are just in this detached kind of mode the emperor mode let's clarify the emperor we have the 9 of wands the knight of pentacles and the 3 of wands you are waiting for something or someone okay and you are in this energy of giving up on this person on this person or on this energy like uh, 90% but 10% still you are holding on to this hope that with each passing day you are getting a uh, nearer to your uh, person nearer to the, your goals whatever goal or whatever specific person you have in your mind you feel like this person or this energy is going to come towards you slowly but surely and you have to keep moving forward and you have to remain detached from the outcome and this is what you are doing so you know energies are not uh, like uh, directed towards a specific energy or a specific person to be honest that that much uh, to your goal it's very attached so there is a goal or there is a energy that you are very attached to um, although you have given up on that on that goal or on that person or energy but you know that uh, art of detachment is going to get you what you really want so you feel like you should remain still and just wait okay this is what you feel and everything is going to come towards you so you are letting go of the stressful kind of energy and the burdensome and heavy kind of energy and you are standing still and you are just uh, 
uh, waiting for things to come towards you not chasing them or running behind them so right now you are in this energy of i don't chase i attract kind of attitude very good let's see what this person wants from you what are their intentions for the situation leo i'm sorry i have a little cold as usual Queen of Wands, bottom of the deck is the Seven of Cups. This person wants to manifest something very beautiful here. Uh, they want to create a beautiful world around them. They want to have uh, a personality like you, have strength like you. Let me clarify this, then we will see the clear picture of what this is. What this is. I think it is uh, a friendship kind of energy or you guys used to have a connection at some point of time but things didn't work out. Now this person is trying to keep their distance but at the same time they are... Uh, very much influenced uh, the, like uh, by the way you are the way you are handling your life and things and the way you are growing they are very much impressed by you let's clarify the queen of wands page of pentacles seven of cups and three of pentacles okay this person is manifesting a friendship kind of energy with you a bonding with you again okay and this person is like even if you have other options in your life they want to collaborate with you have some kind of partnership with you even if it means that you are going to keep them as a friend only or even if it means that you are going to connect with them uh, like on a professional level only see this person definitely want to have a collaboration or partnership with you and they are manifesting a friendship kind of energy with you even if you have a uh, lots of options to choose from or it could be possible that this person is also having options apart from you as well but they want to collaborate with you only because they know that you have the potential and you have the energy to make anybody go forward in their life okay and you can help anyone to make them successful because your energies are contagious and uh, they are highly highly impressed by the way you are handling yourself wow seven of cups is twice here so either there is lots of options uh, in uh, like on your side as well and their side as well or there is lots of confusion going on in the situation between you guys one time you guys are together another time you guys are just friends and another time you guys are more than friends then again you are nothing so they are wanting a collaboration a partnership a friendship kind of energy with you even if you want to even if you wish to keep your options open they are ready to be a part of your life okay or even if they have other options in their life they want to be a part of your life as well again even if it if it means they have to be only your friends forever see it's like uh, the energy of somebody wanting you in their life by hook or by crook uh, not not uh, necessarily romantically but they want to keep your energy and they want to keep you in their life even again even if it is never going to be a romantic kind of connection now it could be very much uh, like a uh, like pure and very much new kind of energy who is very much influenced by your personality by the way you behave the by the way you handle things and they want to be like a like a student okay in your life and they want to learn a lot of things from you more than romantic this person uh, wants to learn from you wants to grow uh, because of how you are doing things they want to uh, grow like that in their life okay let's see what do you want from this particular person or energy around you Leo, let's see. Six of Cups. You want some kind of some sort of. Uh, uh, you're still living in the past. Something happened to you in the past. Uh, you had a very beautiful connection with someone. You're still have having some kind of memories or uh, severe nostalgia, or you're still having this energy of having reconciliation with the past person. That's why you may might be putting everyone on hold here. Uh, let's clarify the Six of Cups. Something related to your past is not letting you move to the next chapter of your life, Leo. This is what is happening here. We have the temperance, the justice, the queen of swords, right? Okay, you are waiting. Actually, you are not waiting for the person of reconciliation. For some of you, yeah, you might be. For most of you, Leo, you are waiting very patiently for some kind of justice from the universe so that you can cut the past out of your life permanently. 
so you that can, so that uh, so that you can get out of the past situation past connection completely for some of you it could be possible that you guys were married to each other and there is a courtroom drama kind of thing going on and now you are wanting this situation to end uh, slowly but surely so that you can uh, uh, disconnect properly and uh, start connecting with new people new energies so you have a big reason that you are not able to connect with new energies right now and for most of you the reason is for some of you you are still wanting the past person for others of you you are waiting for the justice from the universe like it may be courtroom drama it could be like uh, you waiting for like uh, something happening some kind of apology message communication from the past person or some kind of clarity or closure so that you can move forward so all you want is the justice from the universe and the clarity and the honesty and then you will move on properly yeah you have faced some kind of deceptive or betrayal kind of energies and you are wanting justice in the situation from the universe let's see what's coming towards you till the 14th of august leo So, um, what's coming towards you till the 14th of August is 8 of Swords. Lots of overthinking, you will be in this energy of constantly thinking about something or someone but not able to find any kind of conclusion or solution to this. I'm sorry about the cold. It makes me look sexy and my voice sexier. <laughs> yeah, let's clarify the 8 of Swords. We have the four of wands, the king of wands and the eight of cups, right. Wow. Okay. You will be taking some kind of action regarding a marriage commitment, long term partnership and you will be finally saying goodbye to that. After a lot of overthinking, after this energy of what can I do, what can I do, what can I do. You are going to come out of a trap, you are going to come out of a mental jail where you will be taking the necessary action of walking away and moving on from this situation permanently now. Till now you might not be able to move on energetically from a situation Leo and this is happening with you from a very very long time now. Like I can, I, I feel it's happening with you like from, from past uh, one to two years now. For some of you two years, for some of you one year. But you are carrying the same energy of trying to move on, trying to move on, trying to move on. But finally, I think you are walking away and moving on completely to the next chapter, to the next uh, connection or next, next situation in your life. Because the more you are going to wait for a past person, past energy to come back uh, and apologize or give you some kind of clarity or some kind of closure, the more it's going to be difficult for you to move forward. But I think finally you are going to find your own closure in the situation. Something is going to... Uh, happen that is going to like uh, make you realize or make you feel like why to waste more time on this situation just move on finally energetically also you are cutting this uh, cutting your cord from this person and moving ahead in your life towards something new or someone new that's really good see heading towards a prosperous life abundant life for some of you marriage some of you commitment long-term partnership with some new uh, new energy new person or like in simple uh, or you can say simply uh, accepting somebody's proposal here hmm. and moving on let's see what is the guidance for you guys in the situation leo Four of Pentacles, Queen of Cups and the Ace of Wands. Okay. See, whatever you are holding on to, whatever, whatever it is, if it is ne negative, positive, whatever you are like uh, not releasing from your system, you need to release that. At some some point of time, you have to release that. If you are not able to do that right now, you will have to do it in, in the future. And take care of yourself as much as you can. You like a kid. The new beginning, uh, the new uh, like uh, chapters, the new lover, the new person, the new job, the new... Whatever the new you are waiting for is going to come forward only when you are going to take care of yourself like a kid and only when you are going to let go of something that you are holding on to from a very, very long time, Leo. 
letting go see this is just a word let go let go letting go it takes a lifetime to let go of things or people or situation i understand that but your time has come that you will be finally energetically also <laughs> letting go of something or someone out of your system and moving on to the next bright chapter of your life with someone new okay i don't see you get it like giving any chance to someone even if you tried to give a chance to someone i think that that didn't also worked out so finally you are saying goodbye to this and moving on yeah this is a good news for you guys so thank you so much for tuning in leo i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste